In this code sample, we first place uh, two links for two files in JavaScript. The first is the underscore library, and the second is backbone. Backbone requires underscore. Over here, we have script element with code that creates the student model. Creating a model is fairly simple. We just refer model. Model is a property in the object that its reference is within the backbone variable. Backbone is a global variable, meaning it is a property in window. So backbone.model, we actually refer uh, an object, an object on which we can invoke the method extend, passing over an object that describes the model we want to create. Here we want to create a model that we can later use for creating objects, objects that on each and every one of them it would be possible to call the function hello. Objects that each time or let's say objects that when they are created the initialize function is invoked object that each and every one of them holds these default values default values we can later get or set with uh, new values over here I just print out to the console the two objects that were created I also show the option to call the function hello on the object that was created in this line so when I try to execute this code as you can see if you check the console you can see that I get the message new student was created twice because I created here two objects you can also see the details of each and every one of these objects over here you can find the attributes each one of them has so the first has uh, these attributes now if you check the values we passed over then you can see that ID and average remain the values I assigned but name that was David in the beginning was replaced with Wonder Woman so we can find Wonder Woman in the first object and if we check the, th the second object the attributes section we can find the same values we passed over over here now if for example I will try to create an object without uh, specifying anything in its creation now as you can see the third object if I check the attributes I will find the default values we specified over here.